Hello and welcome to the J. Chadwick Company, and I'm John Chadwick. We've been making quality aircraft inspection products here in the USA since 1990, providing customer service and tech support along the way. We are in the maintenance manuals for the Army, Air Force, and Navy, and hold NSN numbers and a GSA contract. Optical micrometers are portable tools for measuring the depth of surface damage, and by damage, we mean things like scratches, gouges, and corrosion pits. Quick, accurate measurements improve safety, avoid scrapping of good parts that are still in tolerance, and save time by eliminating guesswork. The optical micrometer is the premier device for this type of inspection. It's simple and easy to use and requires no advanced training. As far as applications, it's used on almost everything, from leading edges and landing gear to windshields, shafts, fan blades, and fuselage skin. And here's a quick reminder of why this all matters in the first place. Parts do tend to break right along nicks and gouges, so please remember to use optical micrometers when you encounter surface damage. Every kit comes with three interchangeable bases for different surface geometries and four lenses for different levels of magnification. There's also a scratch sample plate for practice and demonstration, an LED flashlight, and an instruction manual. The standard setup is with a 10x eyepiece and 10x objective lens, making this a 100 power portable microscope that also measures depth. To use the instrument, we can start by making sure that the power is on. We steady the base with one hand and focus with the other hand. Pressing this button sets the display to zero. To measure depth, we will focus on surface A, set zero, focus on surface B, then read the number on the display, and that's it. And here are the same four steps on the scratch plate. Focus on the good surface next to the scratch, surface A. The scratch itself is just a blur because it's out of focus. Set zero. This becomes our reference point. Now, focus down to surface B in the very bottom. Then read the number on the display. It's a good idea to do this one or two more times to make sure the readings are repeatable and don't let the base move around while focusing up and down between A and B. So that covers the technique for depth measurement and really is that simple. Here are a few helpful tips to keep in mind. Shining a flashlight down through the lens makes a spot which can help locate a target below. Also keep in mind that a portable microscope can be handy even when you don't need to measure depth. Optical micrometers can also measure width. The 10x lens has a reticle eyepiece or graduated scale. Of the three bases, the three-leg base is good for windshields, wings, and fuselage skin, and any curved surface. The four-leg base is good on flat surfaces and ideal for large diameter round objects and leading edges. And the clear base is for smaller diameter round objects and sh like shafts and hydraulic tubing. There are also two separate kits that help get the most out of optical micrometers. There's a lab stand kit and a replicating compound kit for making molds of damage in hard to reach places. Please see our videos on these or find them on our website. So that concludes a walkthrough of the 8400K optical micrometer kit. We invite you to contact us for questions and tech support anytime and we thank you very much.